It's that time again, Transformation Tuesday. And this week we have Jonathan Tucker uh, from Kingdom as well as American Gods. Thank you, Jonathan, for coming in the studio. Men's Fitness, I read it, I, I, I follow, I subscribe. Awesome, we love to hear that. Yeah, it's good to be here. So Kingdom, third season. Mm-hmm. Uh, what can fans look forward to see happening? Well, you know, bigger, faster, stronger. It's our final season. We've done uh, 30 episodes. You'll see in the first few episodes, kind of my character, the springs being pushed down. And of course, if you followed Kingdom, uh, you know that my live wire um, Velociraptor, Jay Coolina character, uh, doesn't do very well when he's under that, that sort of pressure. And you had to go through a, a series of transformations. You did your, your first one when you first got the, the, the part, right. right, in your first season. Then your second season, you dropped 30 pounds, was yep. it? Yeah. So what were those two processes You know, it's a like? mental game. So you can go to the gym five days a week or seven days a week and spend an hour there and not really see differences or changes. Um, Or on the other hand, you can be in touch with who you are, what your goals are, what your limits are, uh, and how far you're willing to push your body when your mind is saying no. But the fact is that people don't want to either put in the effort or people are incapable of overcoming the mental hurdles and requirements that, um, that are needed to to see results right and uh muscle and fitness did a a great piece the may 2016 issue featuring you Mm -hmm. and the transformation you made you mentioned something about this headspace and being in the right place so what do you do or what had you done to kind of get yourself before each session in the gym to to get there it's this idea of like walking through what that day looks like so that there isn't a surprise and so that you kind of conquer the day, because you can't control where you're gonna be in two months, Mm -hmm. but you can control the day or you can control that hour. And um, that visualization from all different ways, from seeing yourself doing the lift to seeing what it looks like from a third party perspective or seeing what it looks like overhead, to also visualizing the day of what you're just gonna look like um, rolling out when you're on those last few reps of a set. Come on, big boy. That's the difference between you know these guys, which you're, which mm-hmm. you're rocking, and you're something, rocking yeah, too. Yeah, and something <laughs> that you know. That, so that guy that you see in the gym, who goes, who's there every day, mm-hmm. and nothing changes. Mm-hmm. I'm lucky to be in LA at a gym called Easton. Easton Gym is the oldest gym in Hollywood, mm-hmm. from 1937. Mm-hmm. Some of these guys are in the early 90s, and they come to the gym all the time. And I, you go up and talk to them. Yeah. Say, hey, man, what, give me what, what, what's worked for you, what hasn't worked for you. Do you have some advice? There's just nothing better than that sort of empirical evidence. And these guys are in good shape. Sounds like a great segment. Jonathan Tucker interviews 70-year-old, uh, man, 80-year-old yeah. old men and getting fitness tips. I mean, every gym has these guys, right? Absolutely. They're, they're going to look back and they're yeah. going to say, yeah, you know, maybe I shouldn't have done this yeah. or maybe I should have done lighter weight or should have done heavier mm-hmm. weight or tried this thing out. Or, you know, if you ask these guys, it's it's the best advice you can get. Yeah. Thank you. We appreciate uh, you chatting. Yeah, yes. no, it's a pleasure to be here. Catch Jonathan uh, May 31st. Yep. May 31st, AT&T DirecTV. Season, Kingdom. Kingdom Season 3. Thanks, man. Thank you, sir.